Okay, folks, today what I'm going to do is go ahead and crack open the boxes on the remaining uh, Cuban cigars that I have not opened. Um, I've got seven boxes that I hadn't opened. I went ahead and, and uh, on each of these boxes, I have already broken the seal on the Habano sticker. I haven't broken the seals. Um, the official Cuban seal there. So I'm going to do that right now and take a look and see what I've got. Okay. These are St. Louis Ray Regios. Got the Nice paper there. there we go. Grab one out of here. Nice dark wrappers. Smell very good, of course. And I'm probably going to smoke one of these today. So, set that aside. And Let's see. Romeo e Julieta. Why Churchill's? Similar to the uh, short church hills, and I do see a little bit of a uh, imperfection of tobacco leaf there. Um, but uh, overall, very, very nice looking cigars. Interestingly enough, uh, if you notice that, uh, you may not be able to see it very well in the video, but we've got a wide church hill there here that probably a little more box pressed than the others. It's a little bit, actually looks like it's a bit of a smaller ring gauge, but neither here nor there. Superiorius and let me Very nice. We've got 
got the La Casa de Albano stickers. I'm sorry, bands. Sticker, well, sticker on the outside as well. Um, And we have a nice dovetail wooden box, uh, Hoyo de Montre Epicure Especial. This uh, box of ten. Second, Partagas, box of 10, Serie P, number two. Quite get through the band on that one, there we go. These are some beautiful cigars. I um, have already gone over the box dates on all these um, in my earlier video. So if you are curious about the box dates, and of course these are all handmade cigars, so each one is a little bit different. CP number two, there's a little bit of a Issue right there with this one. Mm. Smells good. Another one. Another one. Seem to have a a few little minor issues, but certainly not a. Huge problem from the, sm the standpoint of smoking them. So, they seem to have a slightly flared foot. Beautiful. All right. Ramon Alonis, specially selected. These are supposed to be really good. I've never tried one. May try one today. It's a box of twenty five. Perfection in the leaf. A 
Very nice. All right, and my last box is a box of Partagas Lusitanias. Originally, I was um, planning on getting uh, just two or three of these in singles, but the more I thought about it, the more I decided I need to go ahead and get a box of ten. Pegasus sticker. These are nice large cigars. Probably about a two hour smoke. For me, perfect for sitting in a deer stand all day. About 10, 11 o'clock. During January here in Alabama, you uh, do your best hunting and it's kind of hard to sit all day, but if you got something to entertain you for a couple of hours, and this would certainly do it. And uh, mm, nice aroma. Anyway, I, I appreciate uh, everybody joining me and. I'm going to box these back up and get them back in my humidor. Choose one and uh, go out back and try it. So thanks for joining me. Um, I will be uploading some videos from my trip to Cuba, the actual videos from while I was in Cuba. Um, but uh, it's going to take me a little bit of while, a little bit of time to uh, a little while to uh, edit those and and get them cut and everything and, and loaded to YouTube. So I wanted to go ahead and make these other short videos on my iPhone that I can get uploaded. So thanks for watching.